Today we are going to talk about Markdown widget on Flutterflow. It is a new widget on Flutterflow and Markdown will provide you to write long sentences and editable text without rich text or HTML widget. I mean they still will be useful of course, but when you use these, there will be more widgets on widget tree. So Markdown makes your widget tree regular. You will understand better with examples. So before we start, if you still didn't subscribe to the channel, please subscribe for more contents about Flutterflow. Thank you. Okay, let's say we have an article and it includes many words. We want to make some words as bold or launch URL or list. You will not need rich text or HTML to make this. Of course, all widgets has own advantage but when you have long sentences, they will take your time a lot. Markdown is easier than other on this topic. I want to show you some examples and give you some comments. 1. Headline Now let's say we want to make a text as headline. We will select text and put hash in front of text and blank after hash. That's it. This will make text a headline. You can also arrange size of text. You will just put another hash. 2. Bluetooth list. Our second method is Bluetooth list. If you want to make a list, you just need to put star minus plus sign in front of text and this will help you to have a Bluetooth list on your article. There are another more methods for Markdown. I will put other comments to blog page of my website. You can find these other useful comments there. I will make website useful source about Flutterflow. I also made discounts on pre-built projects up to 50% and also memberships. I will also publish second video for members. I will show how you can build a blogging user system on this week. 3. URL our third method is launch URL. Let's say we want to leave a link on a specific sentences or word. We need to define this word with empty square brackets. This will define the word and after that we will put the link next to the word with parentheses. For example, let's say our word is temperature and we will navigate to Wikipedia page after user click to temperature we will do it as temperature and link that's it for bold and italic our fourth method is to make word bold and italic sometimes we want to take users attention to some points on article you can make words or sentences as bold with stars you will put the words between two stars if you want to make italic, then you will put the word between two underscore. 5. Horizontal bracket Our fifth and last method for this video is horizontal bracket. Sometimes using brackets can be very effective way to improve readability. To use them, simply type three hyphens in a row. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment the video. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.